Barrett's esophagus is a change in the lining of the esophagus. Think about it this way. If you have constant irritation in your skin, what happens is that the body naturally lays down a layer of scar tissue to protect itself. In the same way how if you keep having reflux that's coming up, that's acidic in nature, the esophagus then says, hey, I need to defend myself. And it therefore changes the lining of the cells, what is known as metaplasia. And so what's happening in Barrett's in response to reflux is that the cell lining is changing to become something that is a bit tougher. The problem is you're getting a lining that is not meant to be there and therefore it has a potential pre-malignant predisposition, although it is relatively small. I want to emphasize that the majority of people who have GERD or reflux do not go on to develop esophageal cancer. Barrett's esophagus is more commonly seen in Caucasian populations and there are a variety of reasons for this. Amongst Asian studies have shown that it is relatively uncommon. However, because of lifestyle changes and so on and so forth, we are seeing an increased incidence in Asia.